Hello, this is the Provoke Prawn and this is the Astro A50 Gen 4. Now, this is a short video to talk about various problems that you might have with the A50 Gen 4 that people have mentioned in the comments on the unboxing and review videos that I've done. I want to note that I have not had any of these issues because I think the A50 is fantastic. However, I will discuss how to fix them if you have any and cover things that you might be interested in. I've had a number of questions around the size of the headset, the size of the ear cups and the volume problems that people are having whereby the new Gen 4s are too quiet. Now this isn't an issue I've experienced personally, however I have reached out to Astro for a potential fix and they've given me some guidance on how to improve it and I've also seen things that can happen that do affect the volume. I also want to talk about the size of the ear cups because that was another question that came up. Now here in this bit of video I'm trying to attach the mod kit to the A50 but it is the wrong mod kit. They sent me the Gen 3 mod kit by accident. But I think this is a perfect way to show that the size of the ear cups hasn't changed that much. The reason these won't fit is because the magnets are uh, inverse polarity and the ear cups are slightly different shaped. But you can see that the leather style mod kit ear cups and the standard ear cups are actually a very similar size. So if there is any size difference, it's probably negligible. Now to talk about the main crux of the problem that people are having is the issue with the levels, the sound levels are too low people are saying the volume is not loud enough I have not experienced this problem however I have noticed that there is an issue with it when it's set more to voice than game you notice on the ear cup you have the game and voice balance buttons you can press between those to easily adjust the focus on either in-game audio or VoIP audio now I have noticed that if it's set the wrong way if it's set to voice you will hear less of the game and it does seem quiet so one way to adjust it is to do that the other one though is to dive into the software and to make sure that your A50s are updated in terms of firmware and that the settings are all set correctly within the Astro Command Center. In this instance I'm using the PC Xbox One version. It's plugged into my gaming PC and then I dive into the Command Center software to show you what I mean. Now there are reports that previous generations of the firmware lead to issues with the sound being too low and the reason for that is because it's set to focus by default for some reason the default slider for voice is more towards voice than game so you'll hear more people's voice than you will game giving the impression that the audio on the headset is actually really quiet when it actually isn't so it's worth checking that first your firmware is up to date so launch the software and once you do that you'll see the headset firmware version and the base station firmware version and you'll get a notification if either of those are out of date that lets you update them and make sure those are up to date. You can also see you can tweak here the equalizer presets and go between those so it's worth playing around with those if you feel like the sound quality isn't up to the way you want it. The main point though is in the settings and if you dive into the settings as you'll see in a second you can play around with how the voice game balance is working in there. As a noted Astro's team told me that the issue people were having was the firmware version previously would set to voice more than game so there's a preference towards voice rather than the game side of things and therefore the quality of the sound seems like it's lower when it actually isn't so you can see here this is the slider you want and it gives you the default balance now if it's set more towards voice it'll seem like everything's really quiet apart from people talking to you in discord or whatever game chat service you use and the way to get it is to push it more towards game obviously this is a personal preference but it's something worth adjusting I'd also recommend diving into Windows sound settings and playing around with that because I have found also that sometimes Windows defaults it to the voice version rather than game and you'll see what I mean in the sound settings in a minute and again that causes similar issues tweaking around with the profile settings and also with the Dolby settings also makes a big difference and with anything with the audio it's worth checking to make sure that Windows sound settings are set correctly and it's broadcasting at the right volume. So if you open the sound control panel you can then see which devices are which and you'll note the headset has two versions in here voice and game. I tend to find setting it to game is the best way to do it. Make sure that the volumes are at maximum and check all the other settings. There is obviously the option for Windows Sonic and for Dolby Atmos 
as you'll have the two year license in the box so it's worth checking that but making sure that it's set as the default communication device if you are finding it too quiet maybe try out the voice side instead set that as the default I've played around with those settings to get it the way I want it and it works really well for me as I said in fact I found some games to be too loud and it, this little fix is an easy way of getting around it other questions I've had is whether the Astro A50 has the same sort of base station as the Gen 3 version and I'm happy to report it does have optical in and out and a 3.5mm jack on it as well so basically it's the same headset with tweaked audio version 2 and just improved all round. If you have any questions about the mic quality as well the voiceover that I'm using right now is using the Astro A50 wireless mic so you can see what the quality of light is like and also the noise cancelling capabilities because there is the sound of my PC running in the background that you probably can't hear. Hopefully you found this video useful. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Just make sure you check those settings and update that firmware. Oh, another thing is I'm pretty confident that the A50 Gen 4 is about the same size in terms of the headband as the Gen 3. I've not had any issues with discomfort. People ask questions about whether it's too uncomfortable or whether the headband's smaller. I've not had any problems with that either. This has been the Provoke Prawn. Hope you found this video useful. Thanks for watching. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video. I hope you enjoyed it, found it useful, interesting or humorous or all of the above. If you did, please be sure to give me a thumbs up and also drop me a comment and let me know what you liked. And if you really didn't like it, please let me know the reasons why as well with constructive feedback that I can use to improve my future videos. Any feedback is always appreciated. And if you have the time, please consider subscribing to my channel so you get to see more awesome content from me in future. I'm always looking to grow my follower base and also to keep carrying on producing interesting content on a variety of gaming peripherals, game videos, tips, tricks, unboxings and all sorts of other things. Let me know what you like from my channel and if there's anything you'd like to see more of. Thanks very much for your time. Have a great life.